case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2007, the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case of Scott v. Harris, focusing on balancing an officer's actions of public safety against an individual's Fourth Amendment rights. In March 2001, a high-speed police chase ensued when a driver ignored a police signal to pull over. Deputy Scott joined the pursuit and, after other tactics failed, attempted to stop the fleeing vehicle using a precision intervention technique. However, Scott ended up pushing the vehicle with his car instead, resulting in the driver suffering severe injuries and becoming quadriplegic. The injured driver sued Scott, alleging excessive force and violation of his Fourth Amendment rights. The District Court and the Court of Appeals initially sided with the driver. However, the Supreme Court ultimately reversed these decisions, granting Scott qualified immunity. The court cited a videotape that contradicted the driver's version of events and confirmed the danger he posed to other motorists during the chase. Ultimately, the court held that Scott's actions were objectively reasonable and driven by public safety interest, leading to the reversal of the Court of Appeals' decision. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class. 